Why can't Muslims eat pork? Dietary restrictions or food taboos are common in the various religions of the world. For example, Hindus don't eat beef, Jews don't eat shellfish, Seventh-day Adventists are typically vegetarians, and Latter-day Saints don't drink alcohol. Islam is no different. Allah has given Muslims their own dietary restrictions. Among other things, Islam forbids its practitioners from consuming pork. On four separate occasions in Islamic scripture, Muslims are commanded to not partake of the flesh of swine, which is considered haram or forbidden. For example, the Quran states, O ye who believe, eat of the good things that we have provided for you, and be grateful to Allah. He hath only forbidden you from eating carrion, or the flesh of dead animals, and blood, and the flesh of swine, and that on which any other name hath been invoked besides that of Allah. As a consequence of passages such as this, Muslims do not consume pork, the sole exception being if a person is forced by necessity because he or she is starving and has no other food to eat. While the primary reason Muslims do not partake of pork is that Allah commanded them to abstain from it, there are other secondary reasons commonly cited for the prohibition. For example, God also forbade the Jews from partaking of swine flesh, suggesting the eternal nature of this law. Additionally, in Islam, pigs are seen as filthy animals and their consumption is believed to adversely affect the partaker. Finally, pigs are often a source of diseases, like trichinosis. Ultimately, the Islamic abstention from pork shows their devotion to their religion and sets them apart as a people who love God more than they love the pleasures offered through the consumption of popular foods.